Happy Thursday. Good morning. Why are you so chipper? I don't know. We just took it away. Wearing lipstick too. Yeah. Getting all pretty. Yeah. Man. Yeah. What's today? Am I missing something? It's Thursday. Ah, uh, curse. Yeah. Guess who's behind the wheel? Okay. Cause I've been driving. Now you've been driving. Uh, yeah, that was a long time ago. Was it though? No, that was it wasn't. Because of the uh, what was that? Oh, cause your wedding dress shopping and your. Anyway, did I tell you guys I already got my dress? No, I didn't. I bought my dress, guys. Lip, 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 lip. Yeah. Didn't you already tell them? No. Oh, okay. You just told me you were shopping. Yeah. Oh, okay. I only got it on Sunday. On Thursday, as we you said. We've been terrible. With, yeah. Yeah. So I have that my dress. And I am excited to wear it. It's going to take like four months to get it in. But I'm so excited. Where are you going to put it? My mama's. Oh, okay. Is it going you know, gonna to be okay there? Yeah. I'm going to hide it so that he can't see it. Yeah, so. You should tell him the story. Oh, it. okay. So my sugar daddy yeah. here came with me to go pay for my dress. And it took, first of all, they were just, it was just a mess because, like, they have their system where it says what I'm getting. And I told them which one I was getting. I was like, it's the Vera Wang but, one. But there were a couple on file, right? No, the second one wasn't a Vera Wang. There was only oh, okay. one Vera well, Wang. Well, she got on file. confused. It yeah. looked like there were multiple. There were two files. dresses on file, but I was like, I'm getting the Vera Wang one. And she was like, oh, okay, which one is it? The one that, you know, that's there. But Made anyway, by so. Vera Wang. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So the girl got confused or whatever, and then she's like, okay, so I'm gonna be sure that you're paying for the right one. And I told her how much it was. I'm like, it's this, you know, it's X amount of dollars. She's like, okay, I think it's the right one. So she's like kind of sure, and they were having a sale, so she's applying the sale stuff to it. Speaking of which, I'm mad at myself. What? And the fifty dollars off they gave me? Yeah. Didn't use it that day. I have it. The one they gave me at the bridal show. We didn't use it. And I can't use it on my second dress because the dress that I use on has to be $2.99 yeah. and above. And I'm not going to buy a second dress. $3. Man. Yeah, I'm kind of You're upset. just wedding brain all over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So back to the story. So we're standing there trying to like pay and just sorting things out. And then this other lady that was helping her was like, I'm just gonna get the, let me just go look at the dress and make sure it's the right one. So she goes, and I'm like, whatever. Dave and I are standing there waiting for the lady actually helping us, the lady, cashier yeah. girl, to finish um, ringing it up. And this woman comes back with the dress in her hand. She's like, is this the dress you want? I was like, oh my gosh. Pretty much, like, knocks it against my yeah. face. I was just like, whoa. I'm like, really? Really, dude? Like, really? Yeah. I, I wasn't I wasn't happy about that. And, and so. it, it was funny because the girl. Give me a moment. Hello? Hi, it's my mama. Hi. Nothing, hi. I'm fine, how are you? Okay. Uh, we're heading to work. Yeah. No. Yeah, I'll let you know. Alrighty. Okay. You too. Bye. So as I was saying, um, yes. Okay. As I was saying. Because I was talking. Oh, that's were okay. you? No, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go, go ahead. ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> go, go. I forgot already. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So that was a sad situation. So like, I don't know how much he saw of the dress. Obviously he didn't see it on me and it was in a bag. So he didn't yeah. exactly like see what it completely looks like. But really woman, like he's yeah. standing there, you know, he's. The well, groom the, to be. Why would you break the dress? So the, the funny thing is, is what I was gonna say the funny thing is, is the girl, the cashier girl who was helping us. Like we were, you know, kind of being like, you know, you got to You can't just show dresses when the the guys are. She's yeah. like, yeah, you know, normally we don't have guys come into the store, and I was like, yeah, that makes sense. So it should be kind of like, oh, there's a guy here. Yeah. Like, kind of use your head, lady. Like, <laughs> yeah. Right. Just... Yeah. Like I was just like I had to just completely like holy jeez. Like, yeah, you know, it wasn't cool, dumb. man. Yeah, it wasn't that was cool. so dumb. It wasn't cool. So then we told the cashier girl, she's like, man, she's like, did you see it? And he's like, no, I turned, you know, but, oh, people, people. But guys, I am so excited to show you my wedding dress. Like, oh my gosh. Don't go all nasally on us. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently I 
pick it up nasally when I'm excited. She does. You should have seen her when I proposed to her. It was pretty funny. Whatever. It was cute. But it's, it's funny. <laughs> For real though, I'm excited to wear my dress. So, that's my little wedding rant for today. Yeah, right? You got like six more wedding rants <laughs> in you. It's been what stressful. Else? It's been super, super stressful this week. It's stressful? Like... No way. I have never seen that. Oh, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Aren't you funny? <laughs> yeah. We still don't have a venue. Nope. That's a good one. Yeah. That one's actually not stressful, I don't think. No, because we, we have things. We got it, yeah. Yeah, yeah we, we have things. It's just a matter of like doing the whole going back and forth of a couple of them, and then we'll decide on the what. And, and the one thing that... Uh, makes this process a little bit slower is uh, the we're new do they know about the traditional they do know about the traditional. so the fact that there's like you know it's a two day event um, we just want to coordinate all those things so it's yeah. like you know if we love it for the reception that's great but we want to make sure we can have a ceremony close and the traditional, traditional engagement, engagement close, close by. Yeah. Just, you know you want to make sure you wrap all those so people aren't driving up. you know all over yeah. the province 40 minutes yeah. like in between yeah Province, what's a province? Uh, province is a state, but it's called a province. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, I see. Like, oh, is that a note? It's a collection of cities and towns and villages. And no, I think that's a good, good description of it. Yeah. I, I honestly don't know what the difference is. Like, I think it's just because of our government stuff. And why? But why is why, why do we have territories as well? Well, I don't know. That just throws me off. I don't know. Maybe it's like it's too big to make in a province. Well, it does just call it territory. It's just a whole bunch of space that's not really joined together. But Yukon is smaller than Quebec. But is it all joined together? No. Yukon? Yeah. Because the Northwest Territories, and, and yeah. they have the islands. Like, yeah, but... so maybe Yukon has little pieces, that's why it's a territory. It's maybe. not really maybe. a joint piece of land. That's maybe. the best I've got. Okay. Yeah. That's complete. Erroneous, but that's okay. What is? I try. Okay. It might be right. I don't know. Yeah. yeah. Anyone know the answer to that? I guess I could Google it, but. Nah, that's not fun. Yeah. If anyone can tell us, that'd be awesome. I'll wait. And if no one tells us, then I guess you just never know. Just <laughs> wait. <laughs> okay. You're gonna get our YouTube. A video band because you're stealing a Jeopardy meme. Oh, I see. I see. What's up with that YouTube? Yeah, it's we had a, not that cool. We had our uh, one, one video. This was this was a month ago now, yeah. I'd say. Um, the one video we put up, uh, it was like I don't know, ten minutes long. Yeah. And there was like thirty seconds of it. At the very the, end. At the very end, we're in the car and uh, the radio was on. We just forgot to turn the radio off. And uh, Katy Perry song was on. And you couldn't even barely you could hear barely it. hear it. And, uh, and they, they flagged like, oh it for, God. is this content really yeah. yours? It's like, jeez. Really, guys? Like, we're actually helping Katy Perry. I'm just saying. Like, you well, know? I, I don't think that's true. Why? For sure. But, like, if you think about it in terms of, we're yeah. not doing we're not doing anything for Katy Perry. Whereas, yeah. if we advertise, we're like, hey, you can hear Katy Perry. People are going to come watch us. So, Katy oh. Perry's helping us. If it was used like that. Like, I that's see. not what we did. I see. Katy Perry, Katy Perry, Katy Perry. <laughs> <laughs> See if we get flagged for saying yeah. her name four times. Yeah. yeah. Oh man, it's crazy. And then, guys, okay, so I don't know if I mentioned to you guys that my skin has been suffering like nobody's business this winter. Ain't nobody got time for that. Like, what? I mean, like suffering. Oh. Yeah. No, I mean, tell them the story. Sorry. Okay. Jeez. This guy. Um. <laughs> So, I decided to, you know, go all out and just spend my entire paycheck on skin care products. Would you say you went ham? I went ham. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, cool. So, I went and I got, like, I did a little bit of research. I read some, like, forums and stuff. Because, like, my forehead right here, guys, was like sandpaper. It was. It was kind of... Yeah. It was like sandpaper. I just, I've never had that before. And, like, no matter what I tried, it just wasn't going away so like let me just try a different like skincare product line or whatever so I got like Cetaphil that's what it's called Cetaphil like skin moisturizer I got that so I used that for my full body and then I got the Aveeno intense overnight cream 
or some intense overnight facial cream or intense? something. Intense? Yeah. So I put that on every night, and after the first night, like my forehead, like the sandpaper level dropped a bit, you know? And like it's dropped even more, and now it's almost sandpaper free. <laughs> and then the third thing that I bought was this, um, I think it was also Cetaphil. It was like it's a Cetaphil facial moisturizer or something, it's like SPF, or whatever. Guys, I put that bad boy on. Dave saw me. He was like, "You look like a ghost." <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't cool, and it was, I, and awesome. it was the most. It was the most expensive. It was like a little cheap, probably about that long and like that skinny. A facial cream, and yeah, I'm not gonna believe it it's because like, I can't walk out like that. It, it didn't rub in at all. At all. It it had this like blue tinge to yeah. it. Yeah. It it was just so creepy. Oh my it god. Was it was terrible, so and like I was just like, and then it was at a point where. I'm like, well, I don't want to wash my face again to get it off. So I'm like, okay, I tried rubbing it even more, nothing. It just wasn't going anywhere. Camera. Ooh. Nice catch. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, it just wasn't going anywhere. And then I'm like, okay, let me put the Cetaphil on top of it to maybe, like, you know, hide it. No. Guys, it just looked like a hot mess that day. It wasn't cool. Yeah. So I'll never be using that again. So if you guys want it, you know, it's up for grabs. <laughs> I don't know. I just, this is so cheap. You just squeeze it out. I've never like touched the cream inside, and I, I used still, it once. I really. I kind of wanted Starbucks this morning, but yeah, that's alright. Because I'm gonna be stuck at work till like. So we'll get it. We'll get it later. But then I don't get my treat receipt. Do you want it? Fine, we'll go. No, do you want it? No, it's okay. You gotta say. You want it? Yeah. Gosh, you waited almost way too long. No, I didn't. You just go straight. And but I could have gone left. You mean to this one? Yeah. Oh. Anyway, so that's my facial situation. Yeah. And I tried a new, like, um, what'd you call it? Not a twist out. It's like a post twist out style. Yeah. So trying something new if you guys see me looking all crazy or I don't know how it looks, but I think it kind of works. And ignore the fact that I'm all greasy all around there. It's just, you know, I had to super um, moisturize and oil my edges and stuff this morning. So, yeah. Just one of those things. But anyway. What? Nothing. Oh, you were just looking at me. Oh, I, yeah. You were talking. So, I look at you when you talk. Okay. And since we're about to, get to, <clears throat> about to get Starbucks, guys. Last week was so sad with Starbucks. I have a question about treat receipt, but tell your story first. So, went to Starbucks to get my drink. I was all excited, because usually I'll get like two Hortons. But I'm like, you know what, I want Starbucks. Ooh, I'm going to treat one. myself. Oh God, that's much worse. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to treat myself, and I'm going to go to Starbucks today. And we went all out of our way, got to Starbucks, ordered my drink. She repeated, she asked. I remember, she asked, like, do you want a mocha? And I was like, no. A white hot chocolate. She I don't said, recall that. Okay, she asked me, I remember. And I was like, no. Wasn't I driving? Um, no. Wasn't this the one that I dropped? Yeah. Yeah, I was driving, wasn't I? No, I'm pretty sure you weren't. Okay. Were you? I don't know. I don't know, whatever. I'm, but I remember her asking, and nice. it was repeated. Anyway. And anyways, we get the drink, and usually, oh yeah, I was driving, I remember now. Because she gave it to me, and I saw that the lid was kind of like a coffee color, like a coffee with cream color, but it didn't register to me to like... You know, this isn't what my drink usually looks like if it spills over. My drink's usually pure white. And turns Welcome out... Welcome Starbucks. My name is Hero. How are you today? Hey, I'm uh, good. How are you? Great. What can I get for you? Can I get a grande white peppermint hot chocolate? Is there anything else? Uh, no. That's good. More for you. Is that right? Yep. Thanks. Yeah. So, she gave me a mocha. And I don't do coffee in any way, shape, or form. So, I was upset. For two reasons. One, wrong drink. I was all excited to treat myself to Starbucks. Got the wrong drink. I was already at work, so I'm not going to, like, come back. And then secondly, a mocha costs significantly more than a hot chocolate does. So I paid for a drink that's more expensive than I'm not going to drink. That was, wasn't cool, guys. And I tweeted Starbucks, nothing. And thirdly... And I Instagrammed them, nothing. And thirdly, thirdly. you got a bagel. No, a croissant. Yeah, I got a croissant from them, yeah. which, again, I usually don't get, but I was like, you know what, I'm just going to get a croissant from them, and we all know their croissant isn't a dollar, you know? And then, finish the story. 
Well, <laughs> man. And then on her way into work, I dropped it on the floor. Yeah. By accident. And the ironic thing is, the night before, I dropped her supper on the floor. Oh, yeah. On his birthday, when we went out, I ate like a quarter of my meal. Because like, I had stuffed fault. up on bread and stuff. And it was really good. So I'm like, it's going to be awesome for lunch tomorrow. And then Dave picked it up and just dropped it on the floor. And the, just spilled it. The, la the waitress tucked the bag, put the like the take up container in the bag, but the bag was upside down, so I picked up the bag, but there was no handle, and it just <laughs> right out. Excuses. You saw it. Mm -hmm. So two days in a row, this man spilled my food. And things weren't very and, good between us. And Don't mess with my food. 490 days in a row, this woman... I'm not going to finish that. What were you? I don't know, I'm just going to give me attitude or something. Oh, I see. Yeah. But she's just been perfect. Yeah, so it wasn't cool, guys. We were, I was not very happy with him. Especially, like, after getting the wrong drink and then losing my croissant. Like, I had no breakfast that morning. I was just, yeah. It was just an accident. I, I know it was an accident. Can you get your pay thing? My phone. Yeah, okay. Can you get it? I'm getting it. Okay. I'm four stars away from gold. Ooh, yeah. what's that gold? I get my own personalized card with my name on it, cause you know, don't put your name on it. K K K K K. Anyway. Really, that's what you get though. <laughs> you pay nine dollars for a drink, and, you and get... then I get a free drink every twelve stars after that. After that, so you don't get anything when you get gold. No. Jesus. You just get your own card. I already Oops. did it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Stupid scam this whole place is. Don't hate. I hate. Appreciate. I hate. Appreciate. Don't. I hate. <laughs> so lesson of the day, guys, I'm gonna check my drink when I get it. You Thank do. You. Oh, we gotta check. Alright, oh, we're good to go. Good right to go. Feels a lot bigger than a grande, but maybe I'm they not knew they in. screwed up last time. Yeah, I was so not happy last time. It ruined my entire day, like no joke. Just, you don't mess with my food. I'm very like, yeah, especially when I get excited about something. Don't mess with it. You're very what? Particular? <laughs> oh, okay. Well, why did you laugh? I just didn't know how you were gonna describe yourself. Oh, very particular and anal about my food. Hi, maintenance. Yeah. yeah. What else? <laughs> Camera. Why would it fall? I don't know. It was just that bump, really. <clears throat> want to put your name on it. You want that cake, 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 cake. What are you doing? Cake, cake. You remind me of someone in our office. <laughs> You know exactly who I mean. Who's that? Someone barks at our office? Yeah. And just makes weird noises all the time.